welcome back to another episode of World Dance Fitness with Olga. Today I'm joined by my partner Mire, and we're going to teach you some easy steps for Russian folk dance. I don't know about you, but I have friends from a lot of different countries, and sometimes when I go to their parties and they play their cultural music, um, I don't always know how to properly dance to their different styles. So I don't want you to be that person. So please follow along and join us as we learn some steps for traditional Russian folk dance. Here we go. So we're going to explain the steps to you without music first, all right? And so what we're going to do is we're going to walk forward, uh, starting on your right foot. You're gonna walk forward for four steps. One, two, three, jump together on four. Back it up, five, six, seven, eight. When you do that, you're going to have your hands laid one on top of the other, and you're going to tilt your body toward the foot that you're walking with. One, two, three, jump, four, five, six, seven, eight. Excellent. From here, we're gonna go to the side, just like a little grapevine. We're gonna go one, cross back, step side, heel. All right, let's do that one more time. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four. Once you finish four, you're gonna go ahead and turn to your left, five, six, seven, eight. Let's do that grapevine one more time. One, two, three, four, turn, five, six, seven, eight. If you're feeling up to it, instead of just doing a regular turn, you can jump every foot as you turn. So what that means is this. One, two, three, four, jump, six, seven, eight. All right, let's put all of that together from step one. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, to the side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Excellent. From here, all your arms are going to do is present and open, come back to your hips. Present and open, come back to your hips. So that's what the arms and the body do. The feet are going to do a triple step. One, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three. Again, one, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Excellent. From here, we're going to do what is called, uh, in Russian, it's called virovachka, which basically means rope or like jump rope. And you're going to lift your leg out to the side into a passe and step behind yourself. When you step behind yourself, that foot replaces the, the next leg that comes up. And so you're constantly, whoops, my shoe came off. <laughs> so you're constantly stepping behind yourself, behind yourself, behind yourself, behind yourself. Excellent. What we're gonna do is we're gonna add a bit of a jump to this step, so it looks like this. One, two, three, one, two, three. And from here, we're gonna take it into four quick ones. Five, six, seven, again. Slow, slow, fast. Five, six, seven, eight. Excellent. The last step is going to be toe, heel, prance. So we're gonna start toe, heel, now on that same right foot, you're gonna jump. Jump, jump, jump. Now you're gonna do the same exact step with the left foot. Toe, heel, step, step, step. Again, toe, heel, jump, jump, jump. Toe, heel, jump, jump, jump. Excellent. So now that's four or five uh, really popular Russian folk dance steps. Let's put it to music. Here we go. Here we go. 